All right, you guys, so on this particular morning, me and Stinky Man started our day around 7.40 because he decided he wanted to wake up early today. Lately, we've been waking up around 9, so this is pretty early for us, but I was like, you know what? He doesn't want to go back to sleep, so let's just go ahead and get up. So I do take him in the bathroom with me when I'm going to get my shower done. I like to get myself dressed first, and then I give him a bath and get him dressed. So I do take him in the bathroom with me. He sits there and lets me take my shower and do everything that I need to do. He's pretty good in there towards the end when i'm like putting my clothes on and lotioning down he does get a little bit cranky but for the most part he does pretty good here you go, you try and tease with them pictures. You could ride on me just like you ride the elliptical. She said, I'm trying to keep it tight for my nigga. Girl, I like your last nigga. All I need is mental. You know, I'll work you out, get you right with your physical. Always just another interlude. Asking all the question, girl, you know I don't do interviews. It's pitiful that when I'm with them other bitches, I pretend it's you. Oh, you work at Coles, you in dental school. Wife and now you from clothes, cooking dinner too. This particular day was his bath day, so I went ahead and pick out his clothes. I usually pick out his clothes and get him dressed for the day every day, but today I'm going to go ahead and give him a bath. Sometimes I do the mornings and sometimes I do the night. It just depends on his vibe and my vibe. Um, I do also wipe his tongue every morning with these baby oral cleaners. I got this off of Amazon. Y'all, I absolutely love these, and they're, they come like individually wrapped, so I'll link them below. And guess who decided to fall asleep? Like I said, y'all, we've been waking up at 9 a.m but today he wanted to wake up early but he fell back asleep so since he fell back asleep i'm just gonna let him do his thing okay i know i look crazy but i just wanted to pop in real quick on the morning routine lately we've been waking up at 9 a.m so i knew he would probably go back to sleep but y'all when you find moments like this now he want to wake up when i start talking but when you find moments like this especially you know when you have a newborn or a baby you have to like seize the moment so I wasn't going to do my makeup this early, but I figure since he's still sleeping, you know, I might as well do things that I needed to get done. So this is the time where I usually will do my makeup or I'll make me some coffee or I'll spend time with God, you know, just do stuff that I want to do or just get stuff done around the house. And since I know that I need to do some filming for my other channel later, I'm going to go ahead and do my makeup now because I have the time to do my makeup. So if you're a mom or a new mom, and you want like a tip, any tips that I can give so far, I notice like when they sleep, take that time to either sleep or do things that you really got to do. Like when you have that time to do it, you really have to kind of do it right then and there. Um, or unless you know that they're going to take another nap or whatever, like if you really know them, then I guess you can kind of plan it out. But when it comes to newborns or just babies in general, especially younger babies, it's hard to like plan stuff out and like have a routine you kind of have to go with their flow so even though we have things that we kind of do like we do similar stuff around the same time every day it's still like every day is different and like I said I wasn't expecting him to fall asleep I was going to put him and give him a bath but he just fell asleep so I was like well since he's sleeping girl I look crazy as hell but I'm like since he's sleeping I might as well do my makeup and get dressed for the day. So, yeah, I just wanted to come in here and pop in here and say that I'm about to do this. And if he's still sleeping after I do my makeup, I'm going to spend time with God by reading my devotional. So, I just have to pop in here and say that. But now I'm popping back out. <laughs> And since my son was still sleeping, I decided to go ahead and make me some coffee. I usually have coffee pretty much every morning. And I drink the cinnamon vanilla one, I believe it's called. This is what it looks like right here. So I'll go ahead and do my coffee. And then I also just get his bottles done and anything around the house that I need to do. Thank you. 
Alrighty, so my handsome man finally decided to wake up around 9.48 a.m. I'm going to go ahead and feed him so he can be ready for the bath. Um, he does have probiotics, a liquid probiotic in his bottle. I give it to him every morning. Also, I decided last minute to go ahead and do a braid out on my hair, which is why y'all see my hair in braids. I randomly decided to do that. But I'm going to go ahead and get his bath ready. I did get this bath off of Amazon, and you guys, I love it. It's for newborns, and it also can be used for when he starts to get older and can sit up by itself so i really 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 love this bathtub you guys literally just got him all clean just for him to spit up okay mom life but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and do his hair so i put the baby dove textured hair care um detangling cream inside his hair he loves to get his hair brushed and combed so i'm just gonna style his hair get him together and then after that i'm just gonna put him in his swing so i can finish like cleaning up and get everything together so i'm gonna go ahead and style my little guy up and get him ready about to spend the rest of the day editing i have like four videos to edit for my main channel if you guys don't know i have a reaction channel so i have like four videos to edit for that and then i have to also edit this morning routine my stinky man is sleeping okay y'all like i said every morning is definitely different but this is how today went y'all but yeah so i also loved how my braid out turned out this was my first time like actually not my first time doing a braid out but i don't usually do like braid outs and stuff but i love the way it turned out i should have let it stay longer because this side is definitely not dry but honey don't this look like some bundles like girl this look like some i don't know this look like something but this side is definitely more poofy because I didn't let it sit. I don't know. I was just like, let me take these damn braids out. Because they was just like, I don't know. I just wanted to take them out. 
But if I would have let these things sit overnight and I would have took them out like tomorrow or something, I could definitely tell they would have been even more juicy. But yeah, I am really happy with how my hair turned out. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching our morning routine. This is the end of today's video. Let me know down below if there's any other videos that you guys would like to see. Comment them down below. Also, don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias. It'll be down below in the description box with the direct links. Thank you guys so freaking much for watching. And of course, as always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.